Hi guys, it's Jason here from Lowen Roads. We're looking at a brand new Swift Escape 674. This is a 2023 model on a 73 reg. We're going to do a video tour today where we're going to show you around, check it out for you. Now this is a six berth motorhome with an electric drop down bed based on the feet to Cato. Five travel seat belts. Let's check it out. So the Escape has got a really beautiful interior, nice soft cream furnishings, modern LED strip lights going right the way through. This has got two lounges, one at the front and another one on the back. It's also got some nice garage space, an impressive specification, and it's a good all round motorhome with many different functions. So starting on the front, we're on the Fiat Ducato, it's a 2.2 litre engine, 140 brake horsepower. We're on a six speed manual here with your aircon, cruise control as standard, and you've got your entertainment system here, which has DAB radio, Apple CarPlay enabled. You can connect your phone here for, of course, uh, phone calls, streaming music, and everything like that. You've got a reverse camera on this as standard your privacy blinds on the front and your side mirrors. So this is a six berth and to explain how the sleeping scenario works, at the back you've got a lounge which converts into a double bed. On the front you've got this lounge as well that converts into a double bed with the aid of the electric drop down table. So you fold this over, this can be manually moved to sort of wiggle around the living room area to suit how you want it and where you want it to be. You've got your plug up here, your switch should I say, and that electronically drops down. With a little bit of configuration, drop that down to the bottom, pull these seats out on top of the table, this makes a double bed. So two at the front, two at the back, and also above, you've got an electric drop down bed. To drop that above the door, you've got your key and your switch. Simply hold that down and voila, that's gonna electronically drop down. Now this is gonna fit two people up here very comfortably. You've got your real Duvalet memory foam mattress at the top. Now people do ask about electric beds, how low can it go? So at that sort of height there, that's gonna enable you to have it as a double sort of bunk bed, I like to call it. Where down below, if you can uh, use your imagination a little bit here, you've got your bed at the bottom made up, stick your ladder, which is actually just underneath here right now, pop your ladder into the latch, climb up there, and you've got a double bed at the bottom, double bed at the top. However, if you move things a little bit around in here, for instance, drop the kitchen extension flat, drop the table down. This will go all the way down to the same height as the cushions. So right down there. So in actual fact, if you didn't want to use a pair of ladders and climb up, you can drop it all the way down and just sort of scooch on there. Pop back up like so. Now travel seats, it's sleep six, travels five. What I mean by travel seats is of course seat belts. You've got your two captain chairs at the front, which do turn around. And you've got three more in here, which are hidden and popped away. You've got your agouti, agouti seats underneath the, the lounge areas here. So you've got two on this side, one on the left hand side. We have got photos of that if you go to our website and Instagram page. But underneath here, if you take the cushions away, you've got a seat which is gonna pop up one there, one there, then again, one on the other side. So you can take five people sleeps six. Moving on into the kitchen area now, like we just mentioned, you've got this kitchen extension area coming as standard, the Dometic flat bed microwave integrated in there. So what I mean by flat bed is it works the same as a standard microwave, but you've not got a plate swirling around in there. It's all flat and modern. A nice thing about that for some experienced motorhomists out there is when you're driving, you're not hearing the rattle. But I know everybody's got their own uh, solution for that. 
You've got your Thetford triple X oven and grill combination down below. Three gas cookers on the top and electric hot plate. And finally, your Dometic full length fridge with freezer up at the top. And it is, of course, opening both sides for what it's worth. Moving on to the back, the second lounge. You've got nice, this nice bit of storage going across the top and the side. His and hers wardrobes on each side with rails up at the top. Now you can pop a television on the back on this stand here. You'll notice in the back you've got your plug-in points for your TV aerials and everything like that. And hidden away quite neatly behind this door is a dining table. Check that out, how, how neat is that? So you can sit in here comfortably, some dining table area there, and that just pops away in there, well thought out. You've got this little hatch, which actually reaches into the garage down below here. And again, we've got a couple of storage lockers up at the top and down on the sides. Now, if you were using this as a bed and you wanted some privacy, you can pop it open and slide it across. That's gonna give you some separation from the front of the lounge, a little bit more privacy. And there we have it. So this is a 23 model. It does work on the Truma blown air seating, heating. Separate toilet and shower. Nice size shower with your nice marble effect. Now on this model that we're looking at today, you've got your two lay canopy going along the top, solar panel and a detachable tow bar on the back as well as a reverse camera. That's your garage space and of course you've got access on both sides on here which is quite nice. And this side, as well as having access to the garage, it does have some coat hangers up at the top. Now this motorhome is 8.2 meters long. It is over three and a half ton. This weighs in at four and a half ton. So you do need your C1 license for this. And what is quite impressive, it's got a high payload. It's something like uh, just over a ton, I think it is, uh, actual payload in here, which is quite impressive. It's the highest payload, user payload that is, in the escape range. So there we have it, there's a video tour, thank you for watching. This motorhome we are looking at right now is for sale. Go to the description, you'll find full details. As always, thank you for watching, like, subscribe, and we'll see you soon.